and girls, up first on today's list is a very beautiful, however extremely poisonous castor plant. Now, the official name for this deadly red beauty is the Ricinus cumminus, but nobody has time to say that every time, so that's why we're just going to roll with the castor plant. Anyway, this little guy is native to Eastern Africa and India. However, they can be purchased at almost any garden center because of how nice they look. The thing is, however, that the little beans that come along with this plant contain the very deadly poison ricin. If you aren't aware, ricin is a highly toxic protein that causes great pain and discomfort wherever it is applied. As little as 350 micrograms can kill an adult. However, if you can survive at least five days after ingestion, then you'll likely be able to make a full recovery. As a result of having these poison-filled beans literally growing inside of the plant, in 2007, the Guinness Book of World Records labeled the castor plant as the deadliest plant in all of the world. As little as four seeds, yeah, just four, could kill a human in just two days. So please, if you ever come across this beautiful plant, you know what your mom used to always say. Look, but don't touch. In this instance, it could save your life. Do you want to get a shout out in one of our daily videos? Well, don't forget to drop a comment down below with the hashtag Supreme Family. Tomorrow could be your day. Now, let's get back to the topic. Dumb cane. Keeping things moving right along into the next clip, I challenge you to find a plant name greater than this one. Okay, are you ready for it? It's called dumb cane. And it's a pretty popular household plant that comes with one really serious caveat. Don't eat it. Seriously. If you try to chew this plant, and especially if you swallow it, you'll end up with sores and blisters all over your tongue and throat. Additionally, the sap found inside this thing can do similar damage, and there are stories of people accidentally getting it on their hands and fingers, or even in their eyes. Ouch. The science behind this deadly sap is pretty unique. It's filled up with small crystals of calcium oxalate. And if you don't know, that's the primary acid found in kidney stones. Yeah, talk about uncomfortable. Now, while the deaths associated with this plant are pretty rare, it can lead to suffocation if too much is ingested, as your throat and airways could effectively be blocked, choking you in the process. So be a smart boy or a smart girl and never mess with dumb cane. Thanks the black tiger snake. Up next on today's list, we'll take a brief respite from talking about the green life as we dive into the animal kingdom for a little bit. And our first volunteer is the black tiger snake. Now, the first eye-popping number that comes at you when talking about this deadly snake is that the potency of its venom is 2,000 times stronger than that of sodium cyanide. Yeah, that's a lot. Now, these snakes live primarily in many different areas across Australia, and to be honest, really don't want to have too much interaction with humans. In fact, if they see one, they're more likely to try to escape, opposed to picking a fight. However, like many other animals in the animal world, if they feel threatened, then they certainly have the ability to attack. And when they do, their accuracy is remarkable. And not only can they kill one or two people with each bite, these things slither around packed with enough venom inside of them to knock down an entire dozen of potential attackers. And what makes matters worse is that if you're bitten by one, the mortality rate is 40 to 60%. That's pretty high. And if that's not enough, once bitten, you have about 30 minutes to get to an anti-venom. That's not a lot of time. Cone snail. From the plants, to the animals, to the bugs. Yeah, up next we have a little guy that may not look very fierce, but certainly isn't one you want to tangle with on a Friday night. Check this little guy out, called a cone snail. This animal possesses one of the most deadly poisons in the world. Coupled with that poison is something unique to this snail. It has the ability to shoot off a harpoon at a speed so fast that it can penetrate the rubber gloves of divers who swim down to the ocean floor to recover this snail's shell. And once you're struck with this harpoon and the poison is released, then the horrible effect kicks in. Everything from muscle numbness, trouble seeing, respiratory shutdown, and even death. And that'd be a pretty sad way to go, especially if you got struck by one of these while doing some scuba diving on your summer vacation. Another example that even the tiniest of lives will still do anything they can in order to survive. One last fun fact about cone snails, it actually has a subspecies with many similar characteristics, however, with one startling difference. It's called the cigarette snail cone, and the reason behind that is that once you're bitten by it, you only have enough time to smoke one cigarette. Ouch. 
Blue Ring Octopus. Up next on today's countdown, we're back to the animals and we'll dive into the water and check out the Blue Ring Octopus. And while this thing does look kind of cute, I wouldn't let that throw you off. This is one of the most deadly creatures in any waters across the globe. Typically found in the Pacific and Indian Oceans, there are four different species, with all of them being absolutely venomous. With an average size of only four inches, and just minutes after being bitten by one, the symptoms will start to settle in. Your face gets numb, while the rest of your senses will also begin going numb as well, as the venom blocks the quote sodium ion channels, forcing your limbs to lose sensitivity and go numb. While the reaction to these bites isn't necessarily deadly, there is no antivenom. So unfortunately, its victims are left only with the option of waiting it out. Ouch. Fleas. Okay, so real quick, I know that with it being 2018, most of our association with the world of fleas will likely only cause our attention to rise up for our pets. Yeah, our four-legged friends that are so subject to attracting this nuisance of a bug. However, not such a long time ago, fleas were one of the deadliest creatures on the planet. All right, so let's crack open our history books and talk about the Black Death. If you aren't aware, this condition nearly sunk Europe in the Middle Ages, affecting countless people in all corners. The flea, which feeds on blood, can and has spread diseases between animals and humans. And while we may not think of the flea as a particularly agile or athletic creature, it is capable of jumping over 150 times its own height, which makes it a piece of cake to jump from animal to animal or animal to human. Also, the flea can consume up to 15 times its own body weight every single day. I don't know if that's remarkable or disgusting, but just know where there are fleas, there are leaves. No way, that didn't, uh, whatever. You know what, I just wanted to rhyme. Moving on, giant Japanese hornet. The largest species of hornet in the world is the giant Japanese hornet, and they grow to be about two whole inches in length. Each year, this particular set of winged bugs accounts for about 40 deaths. Once stung, their venom acts as a dissolvent to tissues, so repeated stinging could easily lead to death. With colonies reaching around 700 members, they're extremely aggressive and suspiciously fearless. If you ever encounter a hive of these giant hornets, please proceed with caution. Contact local authorities immediately and just let them do their job. Killer bees. Killer bees, or otherwise known as Africanized honeybees, are very aggressive and one of the most dominant insects in the world. It's widely known that the killer bee, when attacking humans, will attack by stinging you in the mouth and the eye. They'll even follow their victim for up to a mile and will attack in groups by repeatedly stinging their victim. Another crazy fact about these insects is that their larger colonies could contain 800,000 members. Now that's crazy. So if you were ever to stumble into or provoke a killer bee nest, you're in big trouble. Reports say that these bees, once disturbed, stay on alert for 24 hours and will attack any animal or human that comes into their range within that time frame. Fire ant. Fire ants can cause massive damage in a short period of time. They get their name, fire ants, because once they're all over you and start stinging you at the same time, it could give the sensation of being on fire. If ever stung by these incredible insects, you need to apply a cold compress to relieve the swelling and pain. Wash the affected area with soap and water and seek medical attention immediately, especially if you're allergic to insect stings or start to show symptoms of being allergic. Mounds formed by fire ant nests can also be an extreme issue. They attack young animals and infest food and water sources, leading to dehydration and death for other animals. Kissing bugs. Kissing bugs are known to carry the Chagas disease, and that is all the reason you need to know to ensure you don't come into contact with these dangerous critters. These things are called kissing bugs because it has a habit of feeding on blood by biting around the lips and faces of people while they sleep. The bad part is that it isn't the bite that's the problem. It's the fact that after they suck your blood, this insect defecates on the person as well. With that could come Chagas disease which causes flu-like symptoms like fever, pain, and vomiting. In about 25% of these cases, more serious conditions could occur, and in some cases, could lead to death. What's worse is that dogs can contact the disease and pass it on to their owners, which makes clearing your area of this dangerous bug all the more important. 
Proper stops must be taken if you fear you've been in contact with a kissing bug and proper authorities should be contacted immediately. By the way, if you enjoy watching our videos, trust me, you will also love The Brilliant. So go ahead and check it out. You won't regret it. And that's today's video. If you like today's video, leave a thumbs up and share it with all your friends. Also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel so that you never have to miss out on any of our interesting videos ever again. And that's today's video. If you like today's video, leave a thumbs up and share it with all your friends. Also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel so that you never have to miss out on any of our interesting videos ever again.